Are you thinking about signing up to the Pets Table, but you want to know the pros and cons of their fresh dog food and air dried dog food service before you commit to a subscription plan? I placed an order of the Pets Table, both their air dried meals and their fresh dog food meals, to see if it passed the taste test with my picky Elastin Klikai dogs, as well as share how I found their overall service. My name is Kieran, and I'm one part of life with Klikai, alongside my wife Yasmin and my two Elastin Klikai dogs, Sky and Copper. Before I go any further, I want to point out that this is not a sponsored video and the Pets Table have not paid me to create this video. I use my own money to sign up to the Pets Table and this is my honest thoughts based upon my experience feeding their dog food to Sky and Copper. If you click any of the links in this video or in the description below, we may make a small commission. Now with the technical stuff out of the way, let's get started. First, I'm gonna give a brief overview of the Pets Table before I share my pros and cons as well as give my overall verdict on the Pets Table dog food delivery service. So let's start by breaking down who is the Pets Table. The Pets Table launched in 2023 and their dog food delivery service is powered by the well-known and popular HelloFresh company. The Pets Table use high quality human grade ingredients to create their dry dog food and their fresh dog food recipes using superfoods and foods that are rich in fiber to help with gut health. At the current time, they offer two pet food formats, air dried dog food and fresh dog food meals. In doing so, they can cater to the different preferences of dogs and dog owners. The Pets Table explain on their website that their food is made in the USA and they use ingredients from around the world to create your dog's tailored meal plans. Whether you have a puppy, an adult dog or a senior dog, the Pets Table offer balanced and complete recipes for dogs of all life stages. They'll customize your dog food based upon your answers in the sign up questionnaire and make sure that they're getting all the necessary nutrients that they need to live a happy and healthy life by your side. On their website, they explain that their recipes have been vet formulated and vet developed, and they meet the American Feed Control official standards. Finally, just like with HelloFresh, the Pets Table is delivered direct to your door, so you don't have to worry about picking up pet food at your local supermarket or your local pet store again. And you also have the flexibility to cancel at any time, just like with HelloFresh. So now that I've given you a brief overview of the Pets Table, let's take a look at my Pets Table based upon my experience using their dog food delivery service. My first pro would be the easy to use sign up process. If you've ever signed up to HelloFresh or used HelloFresh, then you'll be very familiar with the layout and the look of the Pets Table ordering process. They ask you key details about your dog so they can get to know your dog's age, breed, weight, activity level, and lots more. Once they've got key information about your dog, then the Pets Table will ask you to select which meal plan you'd like to try. Their website is really easy to use, and even if you're not used to signing up to a dog food delivery company, I don't think you'll have any trouble placing an order with the Pets Table. My second pro would be that the Pets Table offer two different pet food formats. They've got fresh dog food and they've got air dried dog food. I like this because some dog owners who are willing to give fresh dog food a try might want to stick with a dry food format rather than switching to fresh meals. There's no doubt that dry food is a little bit easier to deal with. You don't have to make fridge or freezer space and you don't have to mess around with opening up meal packets and getting fresh dog food into your dog's bowl, which can get messy sometimes. Having said that, if you would like to try fresh meals, then the Pets Table will give you that option too. I think it's great that the Pets Table give pet parents the chance to try two different pet food formats and if you're ditching traditional kibble or canned food, you're going to be adopting a healthier approach no matter which of these you try. This leads me on to my third pro which will be the different meal plans available on the Pets Table. You can get a full fresh plan, you can get an air dry plan, you can get a mixed plan or you can get a half fresh plan. So as the name suggests, the fresh plan would be 100% fresh dog food. That comes in meal pouches that would need to be stored in your fridge and freezer. The air dried dog food is just what it says. It's just dry dog food that you can store in your cupboard. The mixed plan is a combination of fresh and air dried together. So you can enjoy both pet food formats at the same time. And if you wanna just feed half a fresh and stick to your current dog food, then you can get half a portion of fresh food sent out every single month. I think the Pets Table provide great flexibility to dog owners who may have different circumstances. Whether you don't have a big fridge and freezer and you wanna get a half portion of fresh, Perhaps you wanna stick with dry dog food and you don't wanna to have to fuss around with having to store meals and defrost meals. Or perhaps you've got a limited budget and you'd like to stick with the dry food because it's slightly cheaper. Either way, the Pets Table are aiming to cater to every single pet owner and their preference and their budget. When I was taking a look at the Pets Table, I liked the fact that there is an emphasis on gut health. So they explain on their website that they use food that are high in fiber and they also add prebiotics to hopefully promote gut health with your dog. So this is a small little element to their business that does give them a slight edge on some other fresh dog food companies that I have previously reviewed. When I got my first box, I was really pleased to see that the Pets Table did include a meal container, so this would be another pro for me. If you have any experience of dealing with fresh dog food, you'll know that sometimes it can get messy. When you have half open packets in your fridge, sometimes dog food can spill onto a fridge shelf or perhaps on your kitchen countertop. 
I like the fact that once I've served the correct portion to my dogs from the meal pouch, I can put it back into the meal container and the food is safely stored in there and there's no cross contamination with human food. Speaking of the meal packs, another pro would be the fact that the pets table offer a portion guideline on each meal packet. So you can actually see how much of the dog food you should feed your dog at each meal time. While a lot of dog food delivery companies do claim to offer pre-portioned dog food, in my experience, only a couple actually follow through on this promise. And the pets table have here by providing this guideline on the fresh dog food packets, which I think is really great and helps dog owners make sure they're practicing portion control when it comes to meal time. My final pro would be that it's easy to cancel or pause your subscription. Just like with HelloFresh, all you need to do is log into the dashboard and you can easily pause your deliveries or cancel your deliveries if you no longer want to feed the pets table. There's no complicated or confusing subscription plans or you don't have to contact the brand by calling them up or emailing them to cancel like with some other fresh dog food companies. So now that I've talked about my pros, let's look at the pets table cons. Just like with any dog food, everyone's gonna have their own pros and cons. These are my cons based upon feeding the pets table to Sky and Copper. I think the first would be the limited recipe variety. Even though they do have two pet food formats, they actually only have three fresh food meal recipes. This is a slightly disappointing amount when compared to some of their rivals who usually offer four, five, six. And when I was living in the UK, there was two dog food delivery companies who actually offered over 10 different fresh food recipes. I would like to have seen a couple more, especially because Sky is a picky eater and I like being able to vary the protein sources and I know she really likes recipes such as pork and lamb and these do not exist within the pets table menu at the current time. Now, while I praise the pets table for the pre-portion guideline on their fresh meal packets, unfortunately, when it comes to their air-dried dog food, they don't provide a custom scooper. Unlike some other air-dried dog food brands who do provide a scooper, so you can make sure that you are getting the right amount of food in your dog's bowl at mealtime, there was no such scooper with the pets table. That's something that I would have liked to have seen. And as the pets table grow their business further, I would love to see them introduce a custom scooper so I can be confident that I'm feeding the right amount to Sky and Copper at mealtime. There's no getting away from the fact that the pets table and most fresh dog food companies are going to cost more than your traditional kibble or canned food that you find at your pet store. Now, if you're watching this video, I suspect that you are willing to pay a little bit more for a dog food subscription and that you're already interested in trying some fresh dog food companies. The pets table are competitively priced, perhaps a little bit on the expensive side compared to some of the fresh dog food companies that I reviewed, but they do offer those four different plans. So hopefully there could be something there for you. Having said that, it is going to cost more than your regular pet food that you would buy at your supermarket or pet store. So that's something to keep in mind and would certainly be a con for some pet owners. One of the weird quirks that I found when I was ordering from the pets table was that I needed to create separate plans for Sky and Copper. What I mean by that is when I signed Sky up to the pets table, once I finished the process, there was no ability to add a second dog to the plan. I had to go and create a new plan for Sky, which meant signing up again and entering in all her details again. I would have loved to have seen the ability to add copper to the plan once I finished entering Sky's details and had picked the food that I was going to feed her. With some dog food companies, when you fill out their sign up questionnaire, there's a button that says add dog and it makes it really streamlined and seamless to add a second dog to your account. Hopefully this is something that might change in the future. But for now, I would say that was a slight con in an otherwise easy ordering process with the pets table. My final con would be the fact that my picky eater just didn't really enjoy their meals, which was very disappointing. Copper is very food motivated and he enjoyed the air dried dog food and he enjoyed the fresh dog food for the most part. However, with Skye, she was very picky when it came to the pets table. I found that I had more success with the beef recipe, but with the chicken and turkey recipe, she wouldn't really touch it. And when she did eat a bit, she wouldn't finish her food. And then Copper would swoop in and finish her bowl. When I looked at the actual meal packs themselves, I did feel they lacked some of the color and vibrancy that I've seen with some other dog food delivery companies, but that didn't seem to stop Copper from eating their food. But with Sky, like I said, it was a slightly disappointing experience. And while I would recommend giving the pets table a go if you do want to try some different fresh dog food options. If you're ready to ditch traditional kibble or wet food that you buy at your supermarket or pet store and you want to give fresh dog food or air dry dog food a go, I would say go ahead and place an order with the pets table. They do offer a balanced and complete and healthy alternative to some traditional dog food formats. I like that they cater to dog owners who may want to feed fresh meals, but maybe some dog owners who want to feed air dried food as well. So you have a lot of flexibility. They also cater to dog owners with different budgets or different life circumstances. For example, if you don't have a big fridge and freezer and you can't store a month's worth of fresh food. Having said that, as I already mentioned, my picky eater wouldn't eat the pet's table consistently. And for that reason, I didn't continue on with my subscription plan. Having said that, every dog is different and maybe your dog will enjoy it more than Sky did. And if that is the case, do let me know in the comments below. So overall, I don't think you'll go wrong with the pets table. I do think that there are other better fresh dog food services out there. 
and other better air dried dog food services out there. But if you're ready to adopt a healthier approach to your dog's nutrition, the pet's table could be a good starting point. So why not give it a go and see how you get on? And like I said, it is really easy to cancel or pause your subscription plan too. So you don't have to worry about being locked into a long-term subscription plan. So there we have it. That is my pet's table pros and cons and my overall verdict on their dog food delivery service. If you would like to give the pet's table a try based upon watching this video, you can get 50% off your first order when you click the link in the video or in the description below. That will save you 50% on your first order and you'll also get 20% off your second box as well. Hopefully after two boxes, you'll have a good idea of whether your dog is enjoying the pet's table and whether you want to continue. If you do decide to order from the pet's table, let me know what your experience is in the comment section below. I do love to hear feedback from other dog owners. And like I said, every dog is different. So maybe your dogs will enjoy it more than my picky eater did. But that's all for me for now. And I will see you in the next video.